I'm Mike Stanton with Build America Mutual. I'm here with Grant Dewey, our head of municipal capital markets for uh, BAM's uh, weekly update. It's July 12th, 2019. Grant, last time we were here, we were talking about interest rates falling to new lows at the end of June. That's all changed in the last two weeks. What happened? Well, it's actually been an emergence of a few new trends. I mean, I think it started with the uh, jobs number last week, and so that came in a little bit stronger than expected. And that was followed up this week with a stronger uh, inflation CPI number. So. Treasuries uh, had a tough week. They ended uh, the 10 years back at a 214, about 10 basis points cheaper than uh, than last week. And and I'd say kind of the new trend is that munis, um, you know, outperform quite a bit. So uh, you know, we look at it in terms of a muni ratio to treasury yields. And so in the 10 year part of the curve, the ratios went from 82 percent down to 74 percent. So a, a full eight ratio move, which um, which we haven't seen in quite a while. It basically reversed the trend of the previous few weeks where munis had been underperforming. So um, we had a bit of a reversal. And, and some of that, I think, is typical when you have Treasury rates rallying. Munis do tend to underperform a little bit. When Treasuries come off, they do tend to hang in there a little bit. So uh, it is a little bit of a directional trend. Great. And so then in the new issue market, uh, after the holiday, returned to kind of a normal volume, about $6.9 billion uh, yep. price this week. Yeah. Uh, uh, so how was BAM? Do, what did BAM do? So uh, we had a good week. We, we wrapped uh, 11 new issues, uh, I would say highlighted by uh, a, UC, a University of California Riverside student housing deal, so where we did uh, about 30, $32 million of that. We're doing some additional bonds on the follow-up. But uh, for the week, we did a total of about $130 million. Uh, in insurance, so it was a good week. And UC Riverside needs the housing. It's one of the fastest growing campuses in the University of California That's system. Uh, we also had a BAM Green Star deal. I saw Har Harris County Municipal Utility District number 150. Uh, water and sewer infrastructure are always uh, good for the green bond principles under the ICMA rules. Um, looking ahead to next week, uh, calendar I think is going to be pretty stable, but more more of the usual, right? Yeah, calendar is going to be about seven billion. I'd say the I think the 30-day visible is up around. Um, 16 billion and uh, you know we're still in this kind of moderate calendar we have negative net supply uh, I saw that that uh, uh, Barclays came out and adjusted downward their uh, their numbers for uh, 2019 from about 380 billion down to 340 to 350 billion so uh, we are running at a little bit of a lower pace um, although people do expect to see a a pickup in the second half of the year, but uh, I think 350 billion is the number. And I noticed some of those, a bunch of those transactions are refinancing issuers taking advantage of those still low interest rates to get in and, and save money by yeah. refinancing their old debt. Yeah. I see BAM's been uh, selected to ensure a pair of refunding transactions for the Kings Canyon Joint Unified School District in California's Central Valley up near Fresno next yeah. week. Uh, it's totaling about $17 million. It's going to be priced by Stiefel, uh, backed by the district's general obligation unlimited tax pledge. Uh, down in Alabama, BAM's been selected to ensure about $12 million of bonds sold by the trustees of the Alabama community. Community College System. They're going to fund uh, refinancing, but also uh, improvements to the Student Center yep. at Sneed State Community College, which is about an hour south of Huntsville. And uh, of course, Grant, you and the desk are always uh, willing to respond to inquiries about secondary market insurance. Sure. Yeah, we continue to see good flow in the secondary, uh, and and so we're reaching out, and we're um, uh, kind of you know it's an important part of our business, and um, these are deals as rates move and the market changes and credits. Uh, we get upgrades, downgrades, uh, you know, there's quite a bit of opportunity in the secondary. Great. Well, that's our update for this week. We'll see you soon.